Hello. And um, good morning. Hello. Uh, I don't watch my own stream. Else, I'm gonna listen to myself. There we go. And pop out the chat. And there we go. Looks good. Stream setup is done. Everything is ready. And um, let's hit that play button. What, what is that sound we can hear in the background? Oh, that's the. It's like a wind wind in like in the background here so we're gonna need some music does Spotify have like some kind of a like cool DMC free DMCA wow the sound in the game is like extremely high there we go we have like a really cool playlist. Um, ah. I can't remember what he's called. Is uh, oh yeah, that's the guy. There we go. So, uh, good morning, everyone. Good morning, Pettigrew. Good to see you. It's just you and me. You and me. What's the time in where you are right now? I like it's seven thirty here, so I guess it's like. Is it like eleven thirty at your place? See if there's like any raid groups online. Strike missions. Twelve thirty. Damn, I was so close. I, I guessed eleven thirty, right? So I was like one hour away from the right, the right thing. Okay. Close one. Um. So we are going to continue my main story <clears throat> I got another hour in me I think <laughs> <coughs> do you have to like wake up in the morning and go to work since it's it's gonna be your Monday See, I finally got this mount. No work, and I don't. No work, and I don't get along. Oh, so you got like free or vacation, or maybe you don't have a job. I don't know. Look, I got this new PP mount. It's pretty cool. Well, feel feel free to let me know why you you're not going to work. You don't have to.
he's a chunky beast yeah exactly it's it's only really usable in pvp like if you use it outside pvp it's not really worth but i really like how he looks so i'm still gonna use it because you know why not i love it it's my new beast Come here, small zombies. Blade storm. <laughs> wow. Holy damn, there's a lot of monsters here. Oh no, I used the wrong spell. I just sacrificed all my health. What is this guy on though? Come on, die, 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 die. Oh. I'll reach out in two seconds. There you go, just need to get away from here. That should get Iberu's attention. Now to the Bone Palace to wait. Oh, nice. Quest complete. Uh, no, no, I'm not gonna fight you. Oh, I have to get all the way down here. What? I'm stuck. <clears throat> yeah, that was a really close one. Uh, what did you say? I'm a disabled guy, so I don't work. I get paid by the government to play video game, man. <laughs> The way you put it out, the way you put it out, <laughs> but, um, all right. Um, I'm of course, well, I, I don't know what, uh, don't get me wrong. I, I don't want to say the wrong thing, but I'm of course, uh, sorry to hear that you disabled if I'm allowed to say that, but you, you know what I mean? Um, but I'm really glad that the government is, you know, that you have, you have a deal and you actually like can do something great with life still. Get, get me get me right you know what i mean like I'm, I'm really glad that the government is supporting you in your way so you can still live your life fully even with being uh, disabled if you if you don't know what i mean but it, it makes me happy to hear that that you have a good solution there but i'm i'm, I'm happy to hear that you're still able to play video games um I mean, you know, some people, they have a, a so high disability that they can't even play video games. They need some kind of, you know, speci special controllers or, or can't play. I know what you're saying. <laughs> exactly. Yeah. I'm, I'm trying to say it the right way without sounding uh, in the wrong way. I know in Denmark we also have, you know, of course the same system. Um, controller manufacturers are getting better about making things for 
Had to be careful. Yeah, exa exa especially Xbox. Like, Xbox is getting so good at it. Um, and all the partnerships Xbox they have. Not sure how they are gonna come over here, but... Uh... Am I supposed to kill this boss? Ah, I hope you all have been ready for this. You, you're the outlander from the casino. Take the Archon out, quickly. Let's get rid of the ads first. Come on, come on. No, I just put it all this underground and you run out of it. Ah, jeez, he's summoning more of these undeads. No, 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 oh. Ouch, ouch, ouch. He's mode. Like... I was thinking to myself, I wonder if killing the ads is the way to go. I believe I, I believe it is because you can see he summons two all the time, and I think if I don't kill them, I actually think he's gonna summon even more. So then there will be two, and then you'll be four, and on. Oh, oh, he just healed himself. Like he just healed him all the way up because he uh, drained his minions. Okay, yeah. Then we definitely have to kill the ads. That's one of the things that I think is a bit annoying about Guild Wars is these story mode bosses, they have like insane amount of HP. Like it, it's actually like a raid boss. Where I'm like, bro, it's just a story. It's like, relax, it's, it's just a story. Okay, I'm gonna go full noob in these mobs now. They have to die before he heals him. There we go. Okay, so now I can... Wait, to my side again? Are you kidding me? And he's throwing like tons of shit on the ground. Come on, come on, come on, come on. I mean, I maybe even need to call a friend for helping this. Come on, kill it before he heals himself. Push. <laughs> no, that's that's not that's cheat. When did he spawn maps? 
Kill them, kill them, kill them. No! That is not fair at all. Oh. It seemed like while he drained and I killed it, it actually damaged him. Hey, JJ Ice Joe, welcome to the stream. Kill that, kill that, kill that. No, kill that one. Kill before. No. Yeah, exactly. It, it looked like when I killed, but they still have so much HP. And I just like uh, the two of the mobs, I got them like very low, but then he drained the one that I didn't attack. Of course he did. Yeah, yeah, come with your mobs. I got them. Now you don't... Oh, sh... There we go. Oh, he lost like 20% of his life. Or 10% of his life. So that is the way to go. Okay, so get them all low. And when he drains one of them, then nuke it. That's actually a pretty cool, like, a uh, little gimmick. Okay, I'm saving all my cooldowns now. Oh, okay, he's finished now. With summoning. Now he's just gonna get, like, very angry. Ah, oh, every time I use a spell on I mean, him, he moves out of it. Oh, he just... I think he just berserked. No, 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 kill him. Oh, if I had lost that fight. <laughs> oh, if I lost that fight, I had to do the whole thing again. <laughs> oh, that was too close. Oh, so I look like this um, guy we just killed, but for some reason they're not changing my skin. Oh, 
Connie Baru. It, it was an accident. Please forgive me, Archon. So does your arrival mean the Sun Sphere uprising has been crushed? Like it never existed. I'm here to deliver plans for oh. Joko's next. They actually think I'm the guy. Of course, Archon. The Grand Vizier is inside, conferring with War Marshal Ecole. Please don't tell Udumishi I attacked him, Archon. Please. My headset is about to die. There we go. Just need a power cable in my headset. So if you haven't followed the mission, uh, if anyone is like watching and haven't seen this story before, um, it's actually because there's like a big war god, like a fire god who's trying to kill, like take over the whole world. But we're now going to use this zombie army to help us. Also confused. I didn't realize Joko had returned. And you know that in his wisdom, Joko has only given me authority over civil matters, not military. Perhaps I misspoke. That's quite unlike you, Archon. You're usually so precise. Or perhaps you misheard me. You must forgive Urumishi, Archon. He can't possibly understand how little attention heroes of battle such as you and I, plead to the job descriptions of civil servants. I should hope the vizier was not questioning the direct orders of his all-seeing king. Oh, no, 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 I would never question the will of the most munificent Joko. Unlike my dear acquaintance, I pledge to you the unquestioned fealty of myself and my warm core. I trust Marshals Ogun and Aronko will do the same. And how might I contact the other Marshals? You'll find Troop Marshal Ogun at his camp southeast of Beijing. He's currently training new recruits there. And Beast Marshal Aronko is drilling the kingdom's cavalry from atop a plateau near the necropolis. King Joko will be told of your assistance, War Marshal. And Vizier. I promise your name will come up as well. Speak with your team privately. Thank you for not mentioning my own. <laughs> now all we have to do is dupe the other two marshals into joining the cause. I nearly slipped up with the vizier. We should split up and see what we can learn about the other two beforehand to avoid mistakes. Can we at least lose these disguises for now? The buzzard stairs are making me nervous. There. Better. <sighs> Much. <sighs> but I think the stench is still clinging to my fur. I believe that was there before. We'll meet up near Vejin and compare notes on the troop marshal. Good luck. Uh, I'm just gonna check my channel to see if everything looks fine. There are live guilds too, Necromancer Reba gameplay stream. And it's tech guild was too. Cool. So we just have to convince rest of the evil guys to join us so I have to get over here ah goddammit spiders 
Set me free. That's your own fault. Mm. Have you done all the stories? Uh, no. It's the first time I'm gonna do this one. And actually, to be fair, uh, I haven't done harder phones. Isn't it called that? Harder phones? Harder phones, yeah. I haven't done that one. So I don't have a glider. Um, but I have done the original one, you know, the, the original um, My Story. Not on this character, but on another character. So it, I've done like the vanilla expansion. And then now I'm trying to do the Path of Fire for the first time. And then I'm, when I finish this one, I'm gonna start with Heart of Thorns to get my glider. Before you head into Bobby, I have information on the point of the group. I had a lot of troubles in Heart of Thorns, the difficulty really ramped up. Oh, really? are flowing in from the I don't feel path of fire is that hard um, but sometimes I get in very like uh, hard situations with like this boss fight we just did sometimes it feels like they f they forget it's a story it's it's like it's not a like a single player game where you cannot it's not like I mean you know what I mean it's not like dark souls other MMOs, the story is always like easy, but that's because it's a story. I wonder how I get down there. Uh. Ow! Ow! Well, I, I survived. Without the mount, I would definitely have been dead. Ah, get away from me. I hate when mobs, they follow you like across half the map. Hey, Dwa. Hey, Dwa. Hey, uh, hello, Velshi. Welcome to the stream. And good morning. Well, with her uh, pedigree saying, well, with Heart of Thorns, we didn't have any new professions. Starting to build that out as you progress was difficult. Ah, yeah, yeah, yeah. I kind of had a, a, like a little bit the same way with this expansion, um, but I did some cheating. I, I did some World vs. World, and then I found out for World vs. World currencies, you can unlock, um, uh, you know, the skills, the skills point you need in here, I found out by playing World of Swords, you can unlock those points. So, that's why I have so, like, so many points in my Reaper build. And I don't know about you, but I hate jumping puzzles, like I really hate jumping puzzles, and this game really likes it. Directly from the most tenacious King Palawa Joko for the troop marshal's ears only. Yes, sir. Follow me. Archon, greetings. Worm Master Ecolo told me you might come calling. Then you know that King Joko has asked me to gather and lead his armies against Balthazar. And I can think of no greater honor than to follow the storied Archon into battle. Unfortunately, the Forge have a huge boundary nearby, 
with a portal they use to refresh their ranks. If I were to leave now, there would be no one to monitor the troops and supplies that are coming in and out of the site. Why haven't you just attacked the foundry and destroyed the portal? Uh, this is a training camp. I don't have the seasoned troops I'd need to attack a target that big. If I did your job for you and found and destroyed the portal, you'd have no excuse not to follow me into combat. Archon, if you can do that with these recruits, I'd follow you into the underworld and back. Maybe next time. For now, just watch how the Morden Crescent gets it done. Then start packing your kit for Kodash. I've only had time to teach these recruits basic combat commands. The Forged have kidnapped many of my recruits. If you see any inside, please get them out. I need all the bodies I can get. I suggest you watch and learn from the safety of your camp. Maybe next time you won't be so cowed by a horde of empty armor. Damn, you don't have to be that cruel. <laughs> um, Pedigree saying, oh yeah, the parkour aspect of the game is way overrated. Yeah, exactly. It's some of the fractals where you have to jump between things or else you fall down and die. Like, no way. Um, well, she's like, depends on the one. Some of them are a buggy miss. Yeah, exactly. That's why I refuse to play Destiny 2. Please get away from me with your jump hustles. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> like, in Destiny, I was actually quite good at them. But I remember playing with uh, people I know that not very good at jumping puzzle, And they kept dying and dying and dying. At least they're not forced on you. No, that's, that's true. I mean... Uh, there is some quest in this game where you're forced to it, but yeah, it's it's not that bad. You like it couldn't do do jump puzzles in the game as a char for the longest time. Do need they fix that? Oh yeah, because of the movement they have, it looks. I don't know. Never played char. I don't like it. Oh wait, the sky scale collection. I haven't done the sky scale collection. Um, I don't even think I can start on it. I think uh, before you can start on the sky scale collection. I think you have to do a Living World Season 4. And I haven't done that one yet. But I really want Skyscale, like, really. Cha is too chunky for me. I like the little Azure dudes. They are pretty cool, I have to give you that. So I'm getting these zombies with me. We are coming with you. Sure, it's now, best for jumping puzzles. With these recruits. I could imagine, like a uh, very small and probably jumps at the exactly position. So melee attack, ranged attack, mommy decoy. Okay, that's pretty cool to like Lead an army of deaths. They really went above the be and beyond with their sure and mini animations. Running and skating to stop, it's hilarious. I've never played, um, like I've never played Ashura. I just, I just can't play, you know, the small races. Minion master build from the first game. 
Oh, uh, yeah, for, you, you, yeah, you're talking about Guild Wars 1, right? Come to me. Ah, we're getting even more recruits. Can I switch out the healing here and actually heal them? Oh, that was the wrong healing. Oh, well, never mind. Attack. Damn. But small hitboxes are best for PP. Yeah, minion masters was great. Like, I played Guild Wars 1 quite a lot, but I was like, you know, I'm like 28 today, right? But when Guild Wars 1 was out, I was like, not that old. Wait, why, why is it like intense heat? Oh, the attacks will oh. Okay, can I heal you guys? Yeah, yeah come here, come here. I don't have any more healing. That's alright, if you just... Uh, Stand still, need healing you. Would you stand still in my healing? Ah, these guys are retired. <laughs> There's an achievement if you have plus 15 at the end. Oh, ho, ho. Ah, do I have any other healings? Like, um. I think I picked the worst class for this mission. You kind of cheese cheese it if you die and respawn since they all respawn. Ah, wait, wait. So if they all die and I die. Do they all come back then? Like all of them? So you, you, you can actually cheat it? <laughs> I am exactly. I am the cheese master. Like if just look at me playing Final Fantasy, skipping all the stories. need to rally oh you need okay so I would have to rally them all again Shoot, 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 There we go. Haha, oh, now he's dead. Why do you have to move when I heal you? If you look at your buff, you'll see the mission achievement. Have at least five, 15 mummies under your command. Take out 10 forge with a single mummy bomb.
Whoops. <laughs> okay, I, I, I just killed one myself. Was that way there? Ah. Kill that rat. Thank you. Suck at this. Okay, so I have no zombies left. Well, I'll come back and pick them up later. So I got four zombies over there. Armor has been mechanized to repel all ranged attacks, turning them back at the attacker. Okay, so four people are uh, into the. Uh... So this guy is immune to melee damage, and this guy is raged. <laughs> oh god. sucked for my thief. I kept killing myself. I can imagine like if you play a squishy one without healing like I don't know if that's what you mean but yeah I can imagine this mission can be really tough. Ugh, come on I didn't hit them all. Kill that guy. Change this worm and ah, come on! No cheating allowed. Oh wait, I can use mount now. Couldn't do that before. Ah, why did I dismount? No, 
No, I'm. <laughs> this is a trap. Game has defeated the cheese master. <laughs> they tricked me. Wait, I can. Yeah, I can summon those. Yeah, exactly. Exactly, and let's go. Yeah, you're not gonna go alive. Could I get some help? Do I really have to say they have to attack? So, where's this going? I don't think I want to go in there. Range of damage. There we go. to kill that thing over there. Oh, he's like a boss. Wait, 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 wait. I must be repel all ranged. No! No! <laughs> repel all ranged attacks. Did that. Did that. Did he have that all the time? Or, or does he like change? You killed my army. No. I don't need you to attack me also. Oh, and now he's immune for melee damage. So now I have to do ranged against him.
I am so dead. Oh, okay, now he repels melee damage. God damn it. Range of damage. Wait, he's repelling Remi- Oh, God. No, that's not fair. So I could theoretically go back. Wait, not there. So wait, so you're telling me that I can go all the way back here? Now that I am the cheese master. Oh, so I'm not allowed to go all the way up there. Then it tells me I'm gonna get kicked. So I have these four people here. Join me. It's just a story mission. Every need in it. Why are you testing us? Exactly. <laughs> exactly. That's what I'm saying. It's a story. I want to progress the story so I can play the game. What a boy. I mean, imagine how many people maybe, you know, um, there has to be some people who's like worse than me. And imagine they if they're not able to like do the missions because they keep dying and dying and dying and dying and dying what about those like they, they will never they will never be able to progress that, that just seems like very odd Okay, I got 11 now. Like, do I have to kill this guy? Oh, he doesn't reset in HP. Oh, okay, okay, so it, it, it isn't that bad. Armor has been magnetized to repel all ranged attacks. So I basically have to melee him. Oh, damn, he's dead, dying fast now. There we go. Ranger, 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 Ranger. Mini, 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 mini. Ranger, 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 Ranger. Ha ha ha. Oh, I think we have to like kill that portal. Imagine if they had a spec in this game like this, where you just had like a zombie army and you just had to like control them. That should bring Ogan on board. But I'm not done. I need... Wait, wait, wait. They all just died. How am I supposed to do... It feels like they have removed achievement, like... Go away, bud. No one want to visit your website. It feels like my achievements has failed after I died. I should. I was pissed they didn't bring first game characters into this game. Yeah, definitely. Yeah, 
And it would be would be super like super cool to have like a summoning build. I know necromancers can summon quite a lot, but still. Okay, we got 20 zombies now. But it feels like both achievements, they failed after I died first time. Oh, there we go. Very impressive, Archon. Your reputation as a leader and a strategist is clearly well earned. I've slowed the forged reinforcements. But the key to stopping them is to take out Balthazar. A worthy goal. When I look forward to helping you achieve, count me and my soldiers in. Assemble your troops and meet me outside Kodash. Once I command the full force of Joko's armies, the shunned god will fall. Cool. But as unpleasant as Casimir's illusion is, it does appear to be working. Uh, I guess so. Next time, how about you three be the awakened, and I'll be your captured char prisoner. Nice try, cuddles. <laughs> that had better not stick. Only one of Joko's marshals is left. Shall we split up and ask around about Beast Marshal Aranko? It worked this time. We'll regroup again near the necropolis. So I need the last one of the zombie bosses to join me. Maybe the whole suicide bomber thing would be thrown upon, but they were such a good time. I mean, Guild Wars 1 was a legend game. <laughs> it was just kind of fun, though. You couldn't jump. Like, imagine Guild Wars 1 is a game where you cannot jump, and Guild Wars 2 is all about jumping and jump parcels. I do, I do believe I read something about Guild Wars 3 coming in 2023 or 24. So they are. It it sounds like they actually are working on the next skill boss. Living in the. The necropolis. Oh, it seems I have to get up here.
I hope they return to the trial. I need a tank, EPS, some heal system, please. Yeah, I know what you mean, like the Trinity system. Trinity. I agree with you, I really hope. Like, I mean, it's fun in Guild Wars 2 that everyone can do everything, but still, a solid tank, a healer, and damage would make this game like 10 times better. And I know if Guild Wars fans, they watch this, they will be like, no, you're destroying our game, shut up. But still, I still think it would be, and, and also they have to do that dungeons actually are worth doing because in this game, doing dungeons is like, there's no reason to do dungeons. The only rate, the only reason you do dungeons in this game is to get armor, like appearance. And that's, that's like it. It's, it's. But I feel like they have tried a lot of playing around with this game and I, I'm pretty sure they can do it like a Guild Wars 3, which is going to be very successful. Hold on, just going to blow my, no my nose. Okay, speak with Beast, Marshal, Uluba, Iranko. Markon, your envoys are meeting with Beast, Marshal, Aranko now. My envoys? I should have never let them go in alone. Hail, Archon. Your representatives and I were just discussing the situation about Baldazar. I see. How presumptuous of them. <sighs> Forgive us, Archon. We meant no disrespect. We sought only to expedite matters, Archon. Mongrels, next time you step out of line, I'll put you back in the graves I salvaged you from. Now go! <laughs> Beast Marshal, might I suggest that the next time Joko sends his Archon to speak with you, you not start the meeting without him? I assure you, Archon. Nothing of import was discussed. In fact, they spoke highly of you, boasting of your superior riding skills. Of course. I like to think my mounted troops are without equal. Would you honor me with a demonstration of what makes you superior? Oh no. Are you questioning my abilities? I mean no slight. But a mounted soldier requires more than just exceptional riding skills. Necromantic draining is essential if you hope to ride against Balthazar's horde. Show me how it works. If your soldiers can master the technique, how difficult can it be? You are most gracious, Archon. This way, please. Oh, hey, Stefan. A name, bro. We both call the same. You know, same name. Uh, hey, good morning, Lagard, and also good morning, Stefan. First, please oh, hold on. Up and enter the paddock. Um, isn't it some what here already? If I recall correctly, when I read in Guild Wars 2, there were uh, people that would build that are tanky and people that were focused on more healing and so on. I I know what you mean. Like, yeah, it, it, when you go to major battle, you can you can find all the different builds, and there already are healing builds and tank builds and um stuff like that and the way you tank is you need more uh, like the, the person with more most uh like toughness is also getting more aggro um i'm pretty sure i read so if you have like a, a lot if you build the equipment with toughness and you play a tanky build then theoretically you can be a tank and as healer but the thing is like healers they don't like the druid healer his main objective is not to heal, actually. His main objective is to actually do might buffs. So he has to stack up might buffs, so everyone has 25 might buffs all the time. It's, and I guess that that's also fine, but it's just, it's just like, it's weird. 
it's weird. I, I played it myself and I just feel like it's weird. <laughs> it's not the Trinity system I know. I know you know I want the I want the way you click on someone and spam heal like World of Warcraft and Final Fantasy. And I know you would say to me, why don't you go play those games? And true. Why don't I play those games instead? The reason for why I actually switched over to Guild Wars was from Final Fantasy was because I know more people who play Guild Wars. In Final Fantasy, it was only me and Pettigrew. Um, but the problem is Pettigrew, he has to play on a US server because the latency on the Europe server is like, it's too bad. Like he, he can't get out of the uh, circles without dying because the latency is, you know, because he's in US and I'm in Europe. So the latency is very bad. But in Guild Wars, I have like a, a few more people playing it. As you approach any of these beasts while mounted, you'll sense that the grasp of Joko is available to you. Use it. <laughs> what I say is that you don't play with me anymore on Final Fantasy. Because you had to switch back to US server because the latency was too wrong. See, what I tried to say is if you if the latency was okay and we could do dungeon in Final Fantasy, I would be happy to do that. But you, you saw last time when we played what the latency did to you. By draining the life from your target, you can imbue your mouth with unnatural speed. My troops use the skill to tame the beast of the valley. Now, if you'll come with me. If you bring half the conviction to the battlefield that you did to my compound, then I look forward to fighting Balthazar with you. With me? Perhaps my companions misspoke in my absence, because Joko himself granted me sole command over his armies. If you're leading Ogun's shambling infantry or Ecolo's worms, yes. But mine is a specialized unit, requiring a particular expertise. As an Archon, I'm not accustomed to auditioning for command. And as this squad's leader, I'm not about to let my troops be slaughtered by someone else's ineptitude. However... Out of respect for the wishes of our beloved King Joko, I'll give you a chance to prove yourself worthy of assuming command. I have a test that measures my core members' abilities. If you successfully complete the Valley Beast circuit, I'll reconsider your request. So if I fail, you still have the honor of fighting alongside the Archon. But if I succeed, History shows you can lead. If you catch the beast with the grasp of Joko three times, you'll prove you can ride. To keep pace with the beast, you'll have to drain creatures in the area. There are also a few shortcuts for skilled mounts. All this chatter, it would have been faster and easier for me to just seize control of your troops. Very well, Archon. When you're ready to begin, simply step through this portal. I think it's like a race quest, but you also have to like capture some monsters. Oh, that is an achievement. Catch the beast of valley five times in a single lap. Okay. Hey, Easy. Welcome to the stream. Have fun playing Path of Fire. Thank you. Pettigrew is saying, I didn't know my leaving you would mean you would stop playing. Now I feel bad. No, 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 no. Don't look at it that way. Like, you could say one of the reasons for why I wanted to continue playing uh, Final Fantasy was because I played with Deacon and you. And leaving Final Fantasy then, would I would feel bad for leaving you again and Deacon. But then after we two couldn't play together, you know, because of latency issues. Then I was like, okay, I, I'm basically leaving no one because Deacon, he has all his friends and guild he play with. So, you know, he doesn't matter. He doesn't care. That's what I was trying to say. He doesn't care about me actually playing the game because he has a lot of people to play with. But if you were able to play the game with me on the same latency, it would be fun. But then because we couldn't play together, then I saw Guild Wars. There was like um, the Stumble Through podcast guys. Uh, Blackout is playing it. Deacon is playing it sometimes also. So...
So it's not because, so you don't, you don't feel bad. <laughs> Stefan is saying, man, if Guild Wars 2 had a progression system like WoW, I would, I would jammed all day. Exactly. Like it's, it's a bit sad that like, when you get the best gear in Guild Wars 2, then you have the best gear. And no matter how many expansions they release, you just have the best gear. And again, I know people would just, just tell me, don't play the game, play, Guild, play World of Warcraft, play Final Fantasy. But what I like about Guild Wars is I had, I have so little spells. I love to just have like 10 spells. It's amazing. As ever, Beast Marshal. Oh, come on. No, 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 no. How am I supposed to catch up on him? Three's all she asked for, but I think I can do more. It's just gone. No, they they won't let you visit uh, my server. They only like you can transfer, but then you have to play always on battle agency. No. 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 Ha 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 ha. That's four. No, I was so close getting five. Inspired riding, Archon. You are truly deserving of Joko's fame. I look forward to leading you and the others to victory against the Pretender God. It will be glorious. Hail Palawa Joko, Scourge of Bobby. something was the mighty archon addressing our pack of filthy mongrels i might have gotten a little carried away back there <laughs> maybe if the archon whistled our marching orders in a higher register put you both back in the graves i salvaged you from <laughs> seriously commander <laughs> okay okay but it did work time to focus on the big battle ahead balthazar Make whatever preparations you need, and we'll see each other again at Kodash Bazaar. Cool, cool. Uh, you had all the spells by level 10, so you literally could play through, what, 70 levels with the same build. Yeah, definitely. And that's that's the thing with Guild Wars. You you play the same thing. You, you have the same equipment. You have the same spells all the time. Of course, you can play around with your build, which is gonna like change. I mean, it changes a bit. It basically changes the whole class with changing weapon and build. So that's a cool thing.
they want me even maybe i'll get the next expansion and start over when it launches i mean i have i have prior well i have got the next expansion so i am gonna play it um but it depends a bit about the, the release time because lost ark and guild wars 2 expansion is releasing the same month which is not very good because i really want to play lost ark but if Lost Ark has been, let's say, it, it, um, Lost Ark is coming out 8 February. And if if that game has been out for like two weeks before next Guild Wars 2 expansion comes out, then it's okay. Then I can take like one bre one week break from uh, Lost Ark. That's fine. But if they release at the same time, I would pick uh, Lost Ark. So... That's Joko's finest. Wretched looking group. Still, they're about to stand shoulder to shoulder with us on the battlefield. So a little respect. Oh, Commander. The Awakened troops are here. But no sign of Balthazar yet. And there's Kralkatorik. Which means we're not too late. I should check in with our Awakened allies before Balthazar arrives. Kaz? Coming up. Let's hope this is the last time. Commander. Wait. I got us into this mess over Sohothan, but you can get us out of it. Thinking back, I now know what Cormier meant. Undo this wrong. The means are in your grasp. You should have it. No. So Hothen is yours. The only thing that matters is stopping Balthazar. When he sees you're not dead, he'll turn his full fury on you and no one else. He won't expect you to have it, which makes this our best hope. I'm honored, Tribune. I'll bring it back in one piece. Yes, you will. <laughs> Commander, I hesitate to mention, but... According to the order, there are three other entrances to the bazaar in addition to this main gate. Joko's marshals have dispatched soldiers to each location, but they themselves have chosen to remain here. If Balthazar shows up at any of those other gates, the Awakened won't stand a chance without leadership. Three out of four chance that Balthazar could just waltz into town. Seems awful risky. I agree. You three should coordinate the armies at each gate. I'll stay here since the marshals have already accepted my leadership. Works for me. Good luck to you, Commander. Good luck to us all. Um, Blackout Gaming. Yeah, I'm hoping they release literally last day in February. Yeah, same. Like the 28th or something. Pretty looking, definitely looking forward to Lost Ark. Yeah, it's gonna be so fun. This next part is quite long. Uh, I have to go work in 20 minutes. So I hope I can do that. And worth doing one uninterrupted session. Can I do this in 20 minutes or do I have to stop? Because I can lock out if it takes too long. your troops on the forged infantry. Marshal Aranko's mounted corps will disrupt their snipers. Marshal Ecolo. Worm Marshal, where is your unit? There, on the front line. Our ranks have shrunk as my worms have been sacrificed for the greater good. But a single properly trained Janundu can wreak more havoc than a hundred of Ogun's worthless worm-eating grunts. Then you target the Elite Forged and keep them off our backs as best you can. Archon, Forged King Scouts Joko on the ridge! Nothing less than total victory! Awakened, take your positions. In Joko's name, let's give Balthazar a proper desert welcome. Marshals, you have your orders. Go! Balthazar will fall. For the glory of King Joko!
All right. Seems like a fun mission, but yeah, uh, you're right. I I don't have like twenty. I I only got like twenty minutes now, so uh, I I can't do that. Don't start this now. Start it now. <laughs> no, no, no. I, I'm I'm gonna quit it. Like, it's it's gonna take too long time. Is that like an NPC commander? Can I join him? It took me maybe an hour to do that one. Yeah, okay, then I'm definitely not gonna do it now. Just gonna paint my armor, two seconds. There you go. Dark armor and dark star mount. Looking real good. Oh wait, I have to take on my right build. Um, there. And we want to play around with the worm. How do I get points in the V for my mount? So there's like two things you have to do. Uh, I actually thought about doing a video about it. Um, but the first thing you have to do is uh, go in here. Uh, like step one, go in here and get one point in Warclaw Mastery. Get one point, just one point. See, just one point in this one, Warclaw, there we go. Warclaw Mastery, just one point. That will unlock the reward track called Warclaw Reward Track. In this reward track, you need the helmet at you're getting you're gonna get in the end, which you have to use. When doing that, and that's like the biggest that, that's like the thing that's gonna take most time. And you have to be, you have to like be active in here. You can see this reward track here. It's gonna give you points when you're active. You don't actually have to like recapture castles or anything like that. You just need to be active in here and do stuff. And then you're gonna get points, which is gonna give you um, which is going to give you the reward track. But look, look here. Uh, achievements. Uh, oh. Claw. Here you see. You need all these achievements to get it. More Claw Emblem. Uh, acquire Emblem by spending one world ability point. So that's basically what you what you're going to get when you use one point in it. Then you can finish that one. Then you have the Gorkut. You get that one when you capture a, a keep. So you just need to be active in here and play and capture a keep. Then you need to capture a camp. Then you need to capture a tower. Then you have to complete the full track. Then you need to buy uh, the body armor for points, like the points you get when playing. Very easy. And then you have to use badges of honor to purchase the leg armor. And unlock the Warclay tail armor by looting it from guards. So basically, when you kill guards, just lose the random one. So, so as you can hear, it's actually not hard. It just takes time. You have to go in. You have to... Oh, eSport Bully. Thanks for subscribing to my channel. But as you can see, it's not hard. You just have to go in, unlock it, start the track, play. It took me three... Three days, I believe. So what can I do if I'm not with a commander? Uh, if you're not with a commander... Uh, you, you can still unlock the track. You can still unlock the, the, the track. Like what I see, what I do when I'm not with a commander is you have to go around and kill these uh, these camps. You can see these flags, these sentries. You can do that alone. 
that's going to give you participant points and then you're going to get points i'm going to show you so i'm playing right now i'm playing right now a roma build a roma build is really good at like running alone and killing so i can like uh, win a lot of one versus ones and so on so i'm going to go into um uh, yeah attrition stuff yeah exactly just things that are going to give you points so I'm going to go into unfriendly territory and kill some of their capture points. Like these. These give pretty good reward uh, killing. But this one is mine so I can't kill it. This mount is so freaking cool. But keep in mind, you can switch between all the four different maps and see if there's a commander. It's always a good idea to so switch between them all. See, is the commander? No, yes, no, yes. There we go. I want to go for that one. The sentry over there. There is a red sentry there. I'm going to go for that one. So far, I've just been running around with a commander in a mass group, but not really understanding what I'm doing too much. Like all the castles you can capture, like, and that's the thing. The more things that your team have captured, the more points you're going to get in the top here. And that's the battle. That is basically, oh shit. No, someone killed my sentry. God damn it. I'm not the only one roaming around right now. I want to play at a slow place, pace, like when work, but if it's quiet. The, uh, let, me, let me show you something you can do. Hold on. These ones are pretty like dangerous to do because the green team could come anytime now and attack me. Thanks for subscribing, man. And welcome to the stream. Good to see you. There you go. So now you can see I can capture this point where I'm standing. And it's going to give me... See, now I got activation. Uh, uh, activation. Uh, activation Blizzard. Now I got a, um, you know, participant. Still getting zero points. There we go. Now I get 25 points every... You can see here, like, next time I'm going to get points. In 4 minutes and 50 seconds, I'm going to get points. Uh, but I'm going to show you what you can do while you're working. So go to one of the other maps, uh, like... Uh, like this one. Okay, let me, let me show you how you can get points. So when you, let's say you're just working and you just want to slack and don't really do much while you're working. These in the middle here, these, you can keep capturing them over and over and over and get uh, participant points. That's what I did when I didn't, when I was not able to find a commander, I did that. And you can find these castles on any of the free maps, any of the free maps here. They all have these castles in the middle here. So I'm gonna go. I'm gonna go over and begin to capture one. And don't try to capture them all on the same time. You lose them every time you run run out of them. So it's it's only simply for getting easy points. Uh, 
Uh, almost there. So that one is already blue, so I don't want that one. I want this one. There you go. I really like this map, like a desert. Superholic, do you play Guild Wars? Okay, no one here. See, so, the, so you basically just run into this one. And when I finish ca capturing it, it's going to give me even more participant points. It's important to know, uh, Blackout, and it's very important to know that you're not going to get points here in the reward track just for capturing a castle. It's this one here, this one here only that's going to give you the points. When you are like active in here and you do stuff, then you're going to get points and points and points. And the really cool thing is it's you can get like tier 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, and it's going to give you more points all the time. And when you have it on tier 6, you can actually have it on for 10 minutes without doing anything. So you could basically go AFK 10 minutes and just get points. I, I, I actually do that. <laughs> See. Oh, I just got a reward. Nice. I almost got it up on next. I'm actually not sure if you get points for defending. I don't think that you do. Uh, eSport Bill, is there anywhere I can go to see a breakdown on points per activity in World vs. World? There is probably somewhere it's gonna say something about that. Um, but not sure where. Since it's it's like, it's anything you do in the world. Anything, killing a sentry, killing a camp, capturing these. They're gonna give you uh, these participant reward. And if you join a group and keep running around with them, it's just going to fill up and get higher and higher and higher, and you're going to get even more points. Sadly, it doesn't give him points for defending it. It would be really fun if I just could stand still here. Yeah. Once it's blue, it's like... Now I just have to run. I mean, it's just next to me, so I just it's going to take me like 30 seconds. Ho ho ho. Hello, little friend. just want to optimize my time there uh, for optimizing your time it's definitely the best one to find a commander so like if you have like a uh, if you look at the map if you can see like there's a batch like a mark like a triangle running around on the map right click on it and then you can join the group and run around with them that's going to give you the best points like uh, that's going to give you the best overall um so, I mean, the best thing in World vs. World is to find a commander and run with them. So, <laughs> Red Team just took this one over. I think I'm gonna... Oh, shit. That's a green one. So, we have a red guy over there. We have a green white. Oh. So it's gonna be interesting. Oh, maybe I could do like a... Maybe we can do like a deal with him. So he could he could capture it and I can capture it and he could capture it and I can capture it. Don't attack me! Don't attack me! We're friends. 
We're friends. Yeah, I, I thought they first wanted to like trade win, but it seems like they don't want it. <laughs> Jeez, master. Oh, they are a lot now. Yeah, I'm gonna get away from here. There are like 10 people now. And the cheese master is back. <laughs> yeah, screw you guys. I'm gonna go away from... When you got 10 versus 1, that's not fair. So my reward tier is now on level 2. So now I'm gonna get 60 points all the time. Every and only in 2 minutes. Let's take this one. I'm gonna annoy these guys. They're like, hey, hey, we're gonna get all the 5 now. And I'm like, no, 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 no. Exactly, they don't need to trade win with me. Not when they're 10 versus 1. Please don't come for me, please don't come for me. Yeah, it's a, it's a shame, Blackout, we don't play on the same server, so we could do this together. At Pettigrew, of course, also. But you're on the US side. Oh, green, they just got all of them. Can I jump over there? Close one. <laughs> Pettigrew, you know what I meant. It's because you're in the US service, of course, we can't do world versus world. Well. But Blackout, he's on Europe. But it's just, unfortunately, we are not on the same Europe server. What? Well, uh, there was a trap. What? A trap again? Ah, oh, what? <laughs> I'm in. Tra <laughs> There's been a ranger. He's like, yeah, I'm gonna put down four traps. That the <laughs> typical like lol when he thinks you're flexing on him with the emotes. Yeah, exactly. I was just like waving, just like as a friendly. I didn't want it to attack. Oh shit! It's nine. I have to go work. And that's literally the voice part of this game. Any MMO that doesn't care about friends, playing with friends is a bad decision. I mean, the game allows you to play with anyone, like, in the open world. So that's, I mean, that's at least a thing. Like, you can play on any server to PvE and normal PvP. But it's only only World vs. World, which is, like, limiting. Okay. Well, I have to go work. So, um... Thank you all for joining my little uh, morning stream. I hope you enjoyed uh, some morning TV show with me. And um, thanks again to our latest subscriber. You can see on top of me is Tipaholic. He messaged his home homies like, Hey, this guy is taunting me. Get over here. <laughs> oh. oh, yeah, you're right. Oh wow, I just realized my stream was way out of sync and I'm responding to things that happened earlier. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Click click on the live. Like it says live. If you click on it, it goes all the way up and you can see where I'm at. What I think like I have like three to five second delay. Yeah. Pedigrew, thanks for streaming and letting us hang out with you this morning. And thank you for joining the stream. I was able to get the kids in the in the kindergarten daycare very early this morning so that's why i was able to stream but sometimes it takes a lot of time to get down the kids at the kindergarten daycare so it's and then i can't stream but uh thanks for watching see you well i mean if if i deliver them early again tomorrow i will be streaming if i don't then i oh shit they could that's kind of they just captured the one so i'm i just feel there's a 10 people
I'm gonna hide. I'm gonna hide here. <laughs> yeah. Have a good day, man. Thank you, Tokoholic. You too. Pettigrew, have a good rest of your day. Thank you. And sleep well, Pettigrew. I know it's very late for you. Bye. Bye-bye. I know they're watching me. See you, Blackout. See you, Stefan. My name, brother. Name, brother. Come out from the shadows. I know you're there. <laughs>